Although all of us have specialty research areas, most of our aquatic sciences and ocean sciences meetings have a broad, multidisciplinary audience. If you want to communicate your research results to an audience beyond your narrow specialty group, you need to make your presentation stimulating and interesting to outsiders. We've sought advice from communications experts from Hollywood, California, to help scientists improve their communications abilities. Although most of our emphasis in the past has been aimed at presentation of research results to the lay public, many of the same suggestions apply to presentation results outside your specialty area to the multidisciplinary aquatic sciences community. Why should you want to get advice from Hollywood actors? Who is better at grabbing audience interest and presenting something than a professional entertainer? We are bringing Brian Palermo for assistance. He is an actor who has been in many movies and TV series, and also he is an acting instructor at the Groundlings Theater in Los Angeles, whose popular alumni include Will Ferrell, Kristen Wiig, and Melissa McCarthy. Brian has led workshops at the Ocean Sciences meetings in Salt Lake City in 2012 and in New Orleans in 2016, and at the Aquatic Sciences meetings in New Orleans in 2013 and in Granada in 2015. Brian will be assisted by Adrian Sponberg, the ASLO Director of Communication and Science, and Jonathan Sharp, Professor Emeritus at the University of Delaware. A specific example, the ASLO meeting in 2013 in New Orleans, I attended many different uh, presentations, and there was this uh, marine biologist doing a, a talk about phytoplankton. And uh, it was good. I kind of got it. And I'm not obviously not a scientist. Um, but in the middle of it, he was starting, he gave kind of a little tribute to this uh, older biologist named uh, Raymond Margaleff. And uh, that was really engaging because like, oh, that's, that was his mentor. It's somebody he, he respected. It was almost a father figure. It was somebody that the crowd obviously responded to it. Everybody knew who Margaleff was. I didn't, but everybody knew who he was. And we were giving notes to some of the presenters that we saw at the Ocean Sciences meeting. And our, our question to that biologist was, why didn't you open with the Margaleff tribute? Because it's human and it's real. And everybody in the hall immediately engaged with that. And with something like that, all we're trying to do is help you with the sequence of your information. It's very important, I know, in, in your world not to dumb down science. It's very important to me that you don't get that idea. We're not about dumbing down your science. We're about making your science communication more effective. On Monday, we will attend several talks that we will then discuss in the Snap It Up workshop on Tuesday. We will contact the presenters of the talks that we plan to attend and seek their assistance in explaining the critique at the workshop. If anyone wants to volunteer to be evaluated, please contact John Sharp. Mm -hmm.